Right, that is the first half of Monday's recovery run done. Eight mile up to my shop. I'm just down the road from it, so I've got to walk there. Um, so I'm going to do some work today. I've got some printing to do. And then we shall get back. Um, I'm hoping to do another eight mile this evening. We make 16 in total. But yeah, I am feeling so much better now than I did this morning. Oh my God, my legs were tight this morning. Um, but yeah, I feel much better now. Um, legs are looser. Still got a bit of pain on the arches of my feet from those blisters from yesterday. Um, but I have uh, put some blister plasters over them um, and they are feeling a bit better. Uh, so hopefully they should heal and sort themselves out this week uh, ready for our peak week long run on Sunday. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna get to my shop get my work done and then we can get back on the road and finish off today's mileage so yeah I'll see you then well this run this evening has been pretty horrible um, it's rained constantly um, yeah I finished work at my shop a bit later than I thought so I managed to get a lift home um, chucked on a coat and a hat and got out for this run I was very tempted to go into the gym and use the dread mill yep the dread mill but yeah I couldn't face running on a treadmill tonight so got out in the rain and uh, yeah got a couple more miles to do so I'm going to get them done so I can get home and get something to eat. Oh, let's go. over tonight. Oh. Wet, horrible conditions. Oh. Bit sore uh, on the arches of my feet from those blisters. Uh, but not too bad. I can run through it so that's not that's too much of a problem. Oh. But that is recovery done. Recovery day done. Um, for peak week so 16 miles in total tomorrow is session with BNR so I'll see you then good morning everyone it's Saturday Park run day. So I am on my way down to Alavada Lake as usual for park run with all of the good guys. Um, yeah, we're gonna have fun. Go nice and steady today because I've got my long marathon session, longest run of the block, which in the middle of it, I'm running Droitwich Park tomorrow. So yeah, it's gonna go nice and easy today. And just get the mileage in. So let's get down there.
more steady parkour this morning. I ended up not being so steady. Started off thinking I wanted to do around 21, 22 minutes. Just not so steady. But I progressively got faster and ended up doing just under 20. So not ideal. Especially tomorrow's one well coming up. But it's all good. It's been a funny old week with the weather. It's absolutely lovely this morning. The sun is out. It's nice and warm. But the rest of the week's been horrible. So on Tuesday and Thursday for the sessions, it was raining constantly. So I couldn't do any filming. Um, which is a shame. Didn't manage to capture any of the sessions this week. But Hopefully, this weather carries on till tomorrow and I'll be able to get some footage of the half tomorrow. So it should be all good. Right, a few more miles back. Let's go. Saturday done. I'm glad about that because my knee is giving me a little bit of a dip at the moment. Uh, I think it's just a build up of mileage and just a fatigue in my legs. So I'm hoping as soon as taper kicks in, it will start to ease off. So, oh well. Walking injury. <laughs> right, I'm going to get home, have something to eat, and get ready for tomorrow's big one. See you then. So we have made it over to Churchfield Farm in Droitwich. Uh, I've just been and picked up my number. I've got the dentist number, 230. Ha ha ha. Yes, I, um, I'm just gonna get ready now, get me uh, shoes on and get out for my warm up because I haven't got much time and I wanna get uh, three miles in before the race. So I'm gonna, uh, get ready and get out there so I'll see you out on my warm-up. So I'm out on my warm-up. I don't think I'm gonna get my full three miles in before the race. Um, I left it a bit late to get out but I'll do the extra afterwards. Um, but yeah, let's get down to the start.
so we're one mile in and of course I have set off way too fast um, current mile is 6.13 so I really need to uh, slow it down a bit Park on left, this one park. Let's go. very much uh, right so just picked up my medal and uh, goodies at the end just put them in the car and set off again to do a few more miles I'm gonna run back around the race route and see if I can find Andy see how he's doing so let's go Yes! 
Sunday. Good lad. And there we have it. Oh, 20 miles for the day. Done. Oh, I'm pleased to get that finished. Oh, total time two hours 15 and 50 seconds. So, that is not bad at all for 20 miles. Average pace of 6.47, which is sub three pace. <laughs> oh, could this actually be on? That's giving me quite a bit of confidence. Oh man. Yeah, pleased with that. Very, very happy. Oh, <laughs> oh yes, let's go. Yo! Right, back in some warm clothes. And I'm just going to go and meet some of the guys for a coffee. media obligations <laughs> <laughs> right so Troy which half marathon is done and look at who I found at the end survivors hey. <laughs> I'm a survivor <laughs> <laughs> so how did we get on then boys it was hard wasn't yeah. it I, I managed to, to, to do it is a marathon effort for me and uh, went to plan got a negative split in there so excellent uh, and yeah. you did seven mile before didn't you yeah. so, so warm up yeah, yeah. so, so mile today. excellent yeah yeah, yeah. Well, for me it was just the half and when are you see but sort of struggled trying to get any speed but felt strong at the end and uh, yeah I'm happy with that so it's good training. First V60 as well? First V60 and a uh, oh, it goes. Da -da -da. county champion gold <laughs> medal. I mean look at that eh? it's proper bling Worcestershire County yes. So yeah I'm happy with that. Amazing. Of Amazon voucher as well. <laughs> yes more they are no yeah amazing so um Next for me and Andy is Manchester Marathon. Three weeks and today. I'll see Donato. you at Manchester. Oh, a yes, bit of a training yes, run. We'll see you there, but you're doing London, aren't you? London Marathon. So, yeah, we're uh, marathon boys. <laughs> Right, so week 12 is done, peak week is done. Uh, yeah, we have hit peak mileage, um, and what a way to end peak week with Droitwich Half. Uh, what a great day. Um, but yeah, let's have a look at what we did throughout the week. So, starting on Monday, as always, with our recovery runs. So I got out uh, in the afternoon and did eight miles, and then, um, got out again in the evening and did another eight. Nice and easy running as uh, recoveries always are. Um, then on Tuesday, it was a uh, road session with BNR and the group were doing hill reps. Um, and yeah, I really didn't want to do hill reps, not during peak week. Um, so I did a nice easy loop with uh, Pete, who is doing Brighton Marathon uh, this weekend. Um, but yeah, with my mileage of going down to the session, the warm up, the loop with Pete, um, the warm down and back from the session, um, I didn't quite hit my mileage for the day and I was gonna cut it short because 
I was really starting to feel the fatigue. Um, so I was going to do a couple of miles on the Wednesday and I got home and just thought, do you know what, just get it done. Um, so I went out and did another three and three quarter miles because I wanted a full rest day on the Wednesday. I didn't want to have to run at all on the Wednesday. So I'm very glad that I just, yeah, got that mentality of just get it done and got out and did it. Um, then on Thursday, um, I got out in the morning and did a nice steady eight miles. And then in the evening, um, it was a track session with BNR. So I still did the session, but um, I did it on the path on the outside clockwise once again, as I have done for the last few track sessions. Um, and it was six times 800 meters off 90 seconds recovery. Um, my left calf still isn't 100%, but it's it's okay. Um, we're going to have little niggles and stuff throughout peak week, so it's nothing too bad. Um, but yeah, so we got through that session. And then on Saturday, went down to park run. And I was just going to do park run as a nice steady run. But um, yeah, I, I ended up doing a progressive pace because I get a little bit competitive when I see people in the distance and try and chase them. Um, so I ended up getting just under 20 minutes uh, for that park run um, and slightly progressive pace. But yeah, it was all good. Um, and then today um, was our longest run of the training block. So 20 miles in total. I ended up doing um, 2.8 miles warm up to the start line. And then I ran the Droitwich half, which I was gonna do at marathon pace, but I started off and of course I set off too quick, um, but I decided to just keep it going um, and see how long I could hold up that slightly quicker pace. Um, and in the end, I'm managed to uh, finish the Droitwich half in one hour, 23 minutes and 53 seconds. I came fifth overall. Um, I was for, uh, first in the V40 category, so in my age group. Um, and then I, uh, the Droitwich half is also the Worcestershire County Champs half marathon. Um, so I got silver in the V40 category in that. So yeah, I got a little silver medal to go with it. So yeah, it was ace. Um, and then I chucked stuff in the car and went out and did another 4.1 miles as a warm down. Um, so yeah, that 20 miles I managed to do in two hours, 15 minutes and 50 seconds at an average pace of six minutes, 47 a mile, which is actually sub three hour marathon pace for the whole 20 miles, including the warm up and the warm down. So yeah, that did give me quite a bit of confidence going into our taper weeks ready for Manchester. Um, but yeah, it was a really good day. It's great to see Andy again. He ran ace. He actually did seven miles on the way down to the half, then raced the half um, and he ran really, really well. So fair play, Andy. Great running. Um, and it was great to meet Donato face to face for the first time. So yeah, really good to uh, meet him too. But yeah, a really good day and a great way to end um, our peak mileage week. So let's have a look at uh, the mileage we did. Monday, we did 16.02. Tuesday, 16.49. Thursday, 19.28. Saturday, 13.34. And then on the Sunday long run, we did 20.02, including that Droitwich half. So that gives us a total for the week of 85.15 mile. So we have smashed through that 80 mile um, marker that I wanted to hit for peak week. We've actually gone up to 85 mile. So very, very happy with that. Um, but yeah, from now it's all about taper. We have hit peak week. Um, yeah, and in three weeks time, we will be on that start line for Manchester Marathon. So yeah, thank you for watching this video. Thank you for joining me on this journey. Uh, if you haven't done so yet, please think about subscribing to the channel and giving this video a like. And yeah, I will see you on Taper Week. Cheers, guys.
Oh, <laughs> oh yes, let's go.